Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Reptiles and Resin. I know I'm crazy. Okay, so today we're doing the wolf moon. <coughs> Excuse me, and I change coasters. I think I, I'm letting my paddle drain in this one. I think I'm going to do the geode round coaster for this one. I just think it would look better. That's just my personal preference. We're using the same um, crystal diamond that you find at Wally World or Walmart, whatever you want to call it. Um, let me show you what the container looks like. Oh, This is a new one I just picked up, so it's this one, extra fine. And this, this is what it is, the um, crystal diamond is what it's called. I think it's like $3.50, something like that. But yeah, that's what I'm using. And instead of the bright rod, light rod yellow, not bright, we are going to just use the white, which looks like a silvery. And I swear they've got crushed crystal in here because as soon as I open it up, flakes fly. So this is a white, or as close to a white mica as you're probably going to get. So that's going to be our moon. And we have a new mix called Desert Sunset. I just mixed this last night and finally got it. It took me a few days to get it perfected. I had to add a few colors to it. But yeah, this is the one we're going to try on the wolf today. So let's get started. I basically, I made up too much. I've got 13 ounces. And I know this coaster is not going to hold 13 like the other one. I mean, like three or four it's probably only going to hold two ounces. So, yeah. And I changed my mind after I had done poured the resin together before I started mixing it. I was like, you know what? Let me get the geode coaster. Yeah. So, that's what we're going with. So, I know I'll be able to fill those two starfish up again. Alright. So, I'm going to pour some out here. And this is going to just be for my glitter. Uh, let me go on and move this paddle. I'm going to go on and pour a little clear in this. And I think I'm going to go on and do two of these. And I'm just pouring a little bit of clear in here. Uh, that might have been too much. Okay, that's for the glitter. I need one for the moon. Okay, and yeah, I'm going to have a good little bit of resin left. Yes, I am. Alright, so I'm going to mix this one, which is for the, um, the, um, moon. And I know I am not going to need that much, but I'll use some of it on the, um, yeah, I see flakes of flying. I swear they got crushed crystal in this. I'm telling you. They have got to have crushed crystal in that. And I liked the way this had looked it and looked in the moon. I really did. I liked the way it looked. So yeah, that's about as white as you're going to get it. I am going to put some more mica powder in here though. Because that's a still a little too clear there. I will get some more mica to go in here. That is enough glitter. I will say that. That's enough glitter considering... This probably has crushed crystal in it. I think that's enough. Alrighty. Let's see how this is looking. Uh, maybe a little bit more actually. I think this thing ain't nothing but crystals. All right, that's going to have to be enough. Okay. Yeah, I think that's nothing but crushed crystal in there. I really do. The same thing as the Unicorn Art crushed crystal. And maybe not. Because the Unicorn, Unicorn Art is much sparkly. So, yeah. I am going to spray just a little alcohol on the top. Okay, now we are going to mix up our desert 
sunset glitter here. See? Very pretty. Desert sunset. And it looks really gorgeous. Alrighty, I need a stick for this one. And I don't need two sticks for that one. And like I said, I kind of want this one thick so it'll stay in place. Oh, that is so pretty. All the colors of the sunset in the desert. If you just look up beautiful pictures of the setting sun in the desert, you're going to see all these colors in the sky. Very, very beautiful. Okay, so I think we're good on that, that. And how are we looking over here? Okay, clean off this. Put this I'm going to wipe this stick off and get all these crystals off of it. Okay, I've got a ton of clear left. Goodness gracious. And I do mean a ton. Okay, so I'm going to just lightly spray this. And I am going to go ahead and pour my wolf. And I am also going to go on and pour my moon. Alrighty. Make sure I got enough in the wolf here. Ooh, maybe too much. Oh, wrong one. Alrighty, so I need some more of the white in here. Hopefully, I don't want to go over now. Well, actually, I think that's pretty good. Pretty darn good there. It looks nice and full and domed. You know, the only thing I didn't like about that fairy is that hand was so delicate. It, it literally is so delicate. That hand was, oh my word, I already got glitter in these. Oh well. It's fine. I'm going to put some glitter in here anyway. That will be just fine. This show made its way in here, whether I wanted it to or not. Okay, so basically, well, da, 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 da. oh, why am I grabbing that? I'm going to put some of this around the edge, just like I did yesterday. Just go on and finish using this off. Oh, I need some for the other one, too. I don't want to use it all on you, buddy. All right, I made one trip around there. Well, two. Trying to get it as close to the edge as I can with these geode shapes here. Not the easiest to maneuver around, let me tell you. All righty. Let's see, I can get the rest of this in here, maybe. Just a little bit left. Oops, get out in the middle. Even though I don't think it's going to really matter. Alrighty. Now I'm just going to pour some of the glitter in here. Oh, missed a little spot there. And get the rest of him in here, I guess.
kind of don't want the center to close up on me because I, I want to put another light there. So yeah, really don't want the center to close up on me. I'm going to just go on and try to dome these off. Uh, yeah, that's full enough. Oh yeah. Okay, we good to go. Goodness gracious, I've got 8 ounces left and I made up, what, 13? Wow. Okay, well, I tell you what, um, oh, I'll leave the spoon in there. i tell you what we can do. We will go on and do another one if that's the case. Instead of doing one tonight, we will do two. Let us do the unicorn. All right, let me move this out the way. We will pour Mr. Mrs. Unicorn here. Um, let's see, we'll go on and add this for the moon. And I need another cup. Where's my little cup set? Need another little cup for the glitter. There we go. Oh, and I need to, some tape to get this out. And do I want to pour a geode for those? You know what? I've already got the mold out. Why not? Let me just get a little bit of this orange glitter out because we're going to use the unicorn glitter on this one. Actually, do you... Actually, you know what? Let's use the the. I have, let's use the y'all know what the unicorn glitter looks like. Let's use the fairy pink glitter that's I have made. Let's use the fairy pink. Okay, what kind of moon do we want? Ooh, what about a light pink moon? Or what about a blue? You know what? A light blue moon. Uh, brilliant blue, slate blue, blah, 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 sky blue, no, too dark. I'm going to mix a little bit of this brilliant blue. Let me see, which one was I using? for? Um, it's already got white in it. Oh, I've never even opened this one yet. Okay, so we're going to do the moon in this one blue. Ooh, oh, it almost chopped my finger off. Okay. Um, slow down, Sheila. You know what? I think that's fine right there. Okay, um, I need another stick. Okay, so, ooh, you know what? I don't want it that dark of a blue. Yeah, let me just, because there's some white in here. I just want a light blue. And it's going to mix with that white as well. So, yeah. I think we're going to... I am going to put a little bit of white in here. I'm going to mix these two. There we go. I'll leave that stick in there just in case I want to add some more. Okay, I am going to go on and get some clear in these two. we go buddies go on and fill these up yeah we'll go on and do this okay so yeah I want this I want it to kind of stay a little light I am going to add another scoop of this okay you know what whatever that is that is yeah that's the cap for that and that's the white from um, small tug the mica powders All right, so see, we get two in one because I am not going to let this resin go to waste and that's way too much for a starfish. Oh, that's going to be a pretty moon. Oh, and it's shiny. Very pretty. All right, so we are going to spray Mr. Unicorn a little bit there. Okay, now what do we need to do? I like y'all can answer me. Okay, this is the blue. We need to do the glitter oh 
I haven't even added my silver spoon to this glitter yet. I just literally finished it. But yeah, I think y'all will really like the pink one. This thing is gorgeous. Okay, I need a stick. Is this one good? I'm gonna, well, maybe I don't need any more glitter than that. And maybe a wee bit more. Wee bit more. I do want it a little thick, like I said, so it can carry or stay in place. I'm gonna throw that over there. Okay, so we've got that, we've got this. And we're going to get two new glitters in one today, y'all. So basically, do I have any more new glitters? No, that's it. These are the last two. That's the only ones I mixed. I've got the um, Hidden Atlantis. I've got the Desert Sunset. I've got the Forest Fairy. I've got the Pink Fairy. And I've got the Unicorn. Woohoo! And that's all I'm coming up with for right now. Okay, so we're going to pour blue. Try to pop a few of those bubbles. Hopefully it goes into his little horn up here. At least that's where I'm going to try to start. Okay, I'm going to put that in. Then I'm going to get my little dotting tool and try to help it into this horn up here. I don't want him left out. And he looks like he has a little horn. I actually kind of wish they would have made this glitter. The, the glitter. The, um, the mold a little bit bigger there. be too much pink oh well <coughs> ah, let me get the other side and oh is that dirty or no no get that into the hair because that is a little point yeah I just kind of wish they would have made these a little bit bigger that would have been so nice but they're still pretty I'm telling you these make beautiful little night lights Okay, I think that's enough blue. Let me get a little bit more. Oh, wait a minute. Is that running over? Or did I just spill that? I probably just spilled it. Knowing me and my look. Okay, I think that's pretty full, actually. Okay, I think that will do us. Yeah. Wipe my hands off. Okay, so now we are just going to pour our blue around here. I know that's not three little bubbles in here, but it is. We're going to have to get y'all, buddy. Alright, let me stop pouring and get these bubbles. Okay, they're not popping because they are on the bottom. Duh. Alright, um, come here. Yes, y'all are. Dang it. Come on up. I don't want to see y'all in here. They're sitting there looking at me. Alrighty, let's see if those will pop now. Yay! Alright, let me get finish getting the rest of this blue. There is a little bit of blue left. Try to get a little bit more in here. Put this down. I'm gonna have to scrape the rest of the cup. So we get two colors in one today. 
So the only thing we'll have to do, I thought this was going to be a four day thing. So the only thing we're going to have to do tomorrow is the black cat. Meow. I love cats. I just don't have none. We've had two since me and my husband have been married. Fluffy and Tiger. Tiger was a tiger for real. He was not a kitty to be played with. But after that, after Fluffy passed away, we just... Well, we had dogs with the cats. But after Mrs. Fluffy went away, she was so pretty. She had one blue eye, one green eye. She was so pretty. Yeah, after Fluffy passed away, we just only kept dogs and then we got some parakeets. Then we had some lovebirds. I loved it, the lovebirds. Those are some awesome birds. Just had some bungees or whatever. Oh my gosh. See, that's what I get from talking too much. The pink got in there. Yeah. Oh well. I think I got it out. I think. Oh well. I tried. I really, you know, the one time I don't want the center to close, it's probably going to close, but I really don't want it to close because I want the light to shine through these. So, yeah, when you don't want something, that's when it's going to happen. And actually, these are so full, I don't think I can. What is that in there? Well, I think it's some unmixed resin. I don't know how that could be. But it is. I could take a little bit more. There we go. Okay, we're not all the way to the top with this one yet. There we go. Okay. We're good on those two. We are good on the... Oh, that pink glitter is pretty. Okay, so we have two ounces left. And let's see. Um, I'm going and mix it in here. There we go. Try to get all this out so I can clean the cup afterwards. All right, so let's see here. Even though this has some pink in it, I'm going to just go on and put some, wipe off my hands a little bit here. I'm going to go on and put some Desert Sunset in here, even though it's got some pink. So, yeah. And I'm going to fill up my starfish. That should be good. Just go on and fill up my starfish with the rest because my resin is starting to get warm. Yes, it is. And this should be enough to finish off that one and um, do the other one. All right, wait a minute. Let me scoot you over. My board is getting full. I don't have the heat mat on right now, so... Other than that, this resin probably would have been cured. Just pour this in the middle and let it run. I might have some more left over. And let me tell you, I don't even worry about these spots dripping no more. Because this mat comes so clean. I love this thing. I don't even worry about it dripping no more. Because it is so easy just to wipe off. Or with tape. Either one. 
All right, come on, you're not wanting to move. You're starting to thicken up on me there. Oh, that blue and that pink together looks really pretty. Really, really, really pretty. All right, come on, buddy. All right, I think I just overfilled that one. Yep, I'm pretty sure I just did. Get some over here on you. Yeah, I don't want it overflowing there. All right, we are good to go on those. Oh, gosh, I got resin. Let me clean up my hands, and we will pour this snail. Well, let me just see if I got another mold. Oh, let's do a crystal. Let's see how this looks in the crystal mold. That's, we got some. I'll just pour this in the crystal mold. All right, get that in there and squish him around. Cause I don't want bubbles. Don't want bubbles. Probably will have enough to fill this one. Yep. Oops. A little pokey thing go poke in here. See if there's any bubbles to release. Because it is getting thick on me, y'all. Hopefully some of these bubbles will pop up. Because the resin is getting quite thick. Oops. And I'm making messes. Alrighty, there we go. Alright, unicorn. Done. This is done. That starfish really cannot hold anymore. <sighs> I'm running out of molds. Run out of little bones. Where's my mini? Let's do the double. Let's do the double chin turtle mold. We all know how he turned out last time. He was double chinned. He was a hot mess. Had to give him a, 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 a um, chin tuck. Poor little thing. Alright, yeah, this stuff is getting thick. I know I'm taking forever, but we're getting two in one today, y'all. Two in one. Hopefully I don't get any bubbles in his little head. I don't think I have enough now. What about his little tail? Okay, wait a minute. I might have to move to the big guns. The spatula. Oh, Lord, let me tell y'all, I have got a sticky mess going on over here. I think I got just as much resin on the outside of this cup as I do on the inside of the glitter cup. I most certainly think I do. Okay. Double chin turtle. That was enough for him. Poor little thing. Alright, so you guys, I am going to just basically, I'm not going to put that in there. Yeah, I am going to clean up and I will see you back for unmolding. Pop you bubble. There you go, yeah, pop, buddy, pop. Pop a little bit of those. All right, I will see y'all back. Oh, my gosh. 
if I can turn off the camera. Hello everyone, we are back with our new project here, 2 and one Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so, I know we said we was going to call this one Pink Fairy, but my granddaughter said it should be called Cotton Candy. So yeah. we're renaming it Cotton Candy. Okay? Um, yeah. So let's go on and unmold the unicorn with the Cotton Candy glitter. Yeah, so pretty. This one came out better, even with the horn. Yeah. So we got that one. That was that's the new name, Cotton Candy. We're renaming it. And this one was the Desert Ooh. Forest the desert with the wolf. The wolf. So pretty. All right, so let's unmold our geodes, and I wanted that clear in the middle. And then this one is the cotton candy with the blue moon. Yeah, we got the blue moon with this. No, we didn't put any alcohol ink in it, honey. Oh. I don't know what that is on that one, but like a little thing there. Oh, it's cool. Let me put this in my hand somewhere. Yeah, you're supposed to. All right, so let's see. Let's go on and unload our starfishes. Little overage in one spot. That's the desert sunset. Glitter. Very pretty. And then this one was the mixed one. The mixed one. With the Ooh. orange and the desert sunset, that actually turned out really cute. This one's different, this one has the same color. And then mm -hmm. this one, like, yeah, it has orange and Yeah. And All right, so we have some left over for a crystal. Yeah. Because apparently I made way too much since yeah. I changed my mind on the, the base mold there. Got a bunch of crystals. I like it. You need to make a oh. pointy. Make okay, a so that's the desert sunset. It's pointy? Yes, honey, it is pointy. Ooh. Look at the little turtle. Yeah, I, I know. We're getting a Mr. Double Chin turtle. Mm -hmm. Oh, he has a lot of overage. And he's mad, so. Yeah, okay. he. he no, he's matte, meaning he's not shiny. And see his double, triple chin there? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to give him a trim this morning. Here, yes. poor little thing. Mm -hmm. We're going to give him a little trim. Yeah. Ow, Come that was it. sharp. Throw that in the trash. Off his head off. No, we just gave him a, a chin tuck, that's all. So he wouldn't have a double chin like Granny. Yeah, Granny. That's right. We got to clean him up a little bit. He got double chins. Okay. There we go. We mini turtle. And then we did not unmold our snail. It was dusting glitter. Oh, if I can get him out. It was dusting glitter that you put it's fine with the You got some overage. Yeah, we just like break the seal. Can you get that out? Not yet. I'm gonna put some of this ever dust. Oh yeah, this had them. the one from the turtle mold. So they family? Oh, and I got antenna. Yay. 
What the antenna? They're right here. Oh, he turned out really cute. He glitched, right? He turned out really, really cute. I'm going to use some of this air and dust and glitter on my stuff. A million bubbles trapped in there, but it actually looks very interesting. Air and dust and glitter. It actually gives it a little character in there. Air and dust and glitter. Elena? Huh? Don't open that glitter. Okay, so I think I'm going to double stack these pedestals here. Yeah, double stack them. And I'm going to use this ATP ADT glass glue, fast curing, high strength, and waterproof. Elena, please. Well, you can play with Mr. Turtle. Go, go ahead. Let me get this. He did turn out just fine, huh? He, he, he not clear. And I'm just putting a little bit. No, he's a matte turtle. He's not going to be clear, honey. Mm -hmm. This one they twist. That's your Ooh. family. I think you're supposed to press this for like 45 seconds. I can't remember. The turtle we with him. 30 mommy. seconds. I got the turtle's mommy. Mm-hmm. I don't know if this is going to work or not. Oh, uh, is that glue on me? Oh, no, that's a piece of loose resin. Okay, it's starting to hold. Yay! Now we got big I didn't want to put it in the middle because I don't want to block my okay. clear. Okay, so we're going to do the same thing to this one. I gotta go to mommy and I gotta go back with the one. Um, Elena, watch out, baby. I got glue in my hand. No, I got it in my hand. All right, let's see here. This is my area. I big. I got plastic. I got hard glue. I got everything glitter. I got a phone controller. A phone controller. No, that's the one. I had to purchase another remote. It was in your, it was in your thing. Can you please put my remote down so that one doesn't get lost? It was in your thing. Oh, he's a little offset. Oh, well, that's fine. Put these together, but they turned out lovely. I love these. I like the glitter too. These glitters are pretty. Alrighty, let's see here. Oh, he's still moving. Let me press him down really good. This one, this one's done caught. Oh God, that's a lot of pressing. Sure, love. Whew, hands hurting after that one. Okay, so let's see here. Oh, he's got a little old bridge right up under here. I'm trying to go on and get that off. Okay, any other old bridge? No. So we're going to try to stand him up a little straight, oops, straighter with this one. Gotta press him in place. Oh, 
in the world is your peepaw doing out there? He must be watching off the side of the house again. All right, we're just trying to hold it in place while we um wait for this to sit. No, leave it alone. Don't touch it. That's that's not to be peeled. Leave it alone. No, leave it alone. Okay, this one's taking a minute to set up. You don't want to cooperate. Um, okay, this out there washing the windows off. He does not want to sit up today. Okay, this glue does not like me today. This thing does not like me today. Yeah, it is not setting up. Ugh. It is not setting up, Peanut. I don't know why it's not setting up. It's a good question. But it is not setting up. Give me a paper towel, love. It is not setting up. The other one did. Yeah, just give me a piece of paper towel, love. Thank you. I don't know why it's not working, but we get ready to switch over. Oh, hopefully I ain't just ruined that. I think I did. Dang it. We're going over to UV resin. Yeah, I'm going to UV resin. I hear you, Peanut. You may be a little too much on there. him down. If it don't work, I'm blaming the glue. There we go. Yay. Let this cure really good. All right, so we got him on his little double base, finally. All right, Elena, turn on the light. Okay. On. Turn the white one on. Press on. And white. It doesn't want to. Hold on. There we go. And then press the white one. It's so cute. Pretty. It's another one. It shines through. No, put that back. I don't have batteries in that one. I'm just open one of them. Very pretty, and he can sit on his little stand. Oh. I like the double geode ones. That's.
very pretty. How do you change this to black? They don't have a black light on there. Oh, did I turn that light off? Yeah, I did. So very pretty little green. wolfy. You want green for the forehead? No, this is the desert sunset. Very, green. very pretty. Green. Really green. Green for the, the glass. Alright, so now we're going to do the, the yeah. unicorn that has the cotton candy glitter. That's what we're renaming it. Okay, let's yeah, see. Which way do we want our geode? Maybe where, where the body? this way. Where his body and we're at? gonna. Well, he's just got the head in the moon. Oh, they the moon eat the body. And we, I want him sitting up like this. So yeah. Yeah, he can't be. He can't be going to see that now. What's up? What's up? He's just got his little head in the moon. That's all. What's up? You can add you with some of your butcher boy. Grandma made that back then. You made that? No, honey, that's my turtle. I've had him for like 20 years, maybe even longer. Yeah. I've had him for a them. very long time. You made them. No, I made one like him. I made a mold of him. Yeah, I, this is a real pet turtle. Okay. Yeah. We had them for our grandma. He's a real friend. pet turtle. Yeah, grandma had this turtle since then. He's older than than, than you are. Yeah, he's he his eyes closed because he's sleeping right now. Mm-hmm. He got his little cool. We we not gonna come off. And we not gonna eat them. Yeah. He moved really slow. And we and he got some stuff taped. Yeah, something. What is mm, that? Um. Uh, oh, I taped up the hole in the turtle so the silicone wouldn't go through. Where's the silicone? Okay, stop talking for a minute. Goodness gracious. Okay. And that's video. our unicorn on the, his geode base or it's her okay. geode you don't base. Have a, you don't have a hole. And we're renaming this one Cotton Candy. But these are so cute. The only thing I'm kind of upset that Let's Resin is did not put the ounces on there. Where's the remote? You got it on green. Let's put it on. Yeah. Let's put it on pink. Ooh. Mm, that's purple. Well, it's supposed to be pink. Leave me a little peanut. Yeah. Very pretty. And we have one more mold to go. Oh, these are so pretty. We have the cat and the moon the left to go. The Where's the cat? The cat in the moon. The cat in the cradle. Where's the cat at? With the silver spoons. Yeah, it's a song. All right, you guys. I hope y'all enjoyed our video of these. I love these molds. They are so cute. And combine them with a stand. Make your own stand. Make your own stand for them. Unicorn with a turtle. Yeah, he, he needs to be shined up and cleaned up. Yeah. And the Mr. Snail. Yeah. Then we had our little crystal. He's too big to sit up there. Yeah. But that would be pretty if you could put yeah. some kind of... Yes, he is too big to sit on there. Unless you put it in the very back. Yeah. Like, scoot that all the way back. Yeah. But, all right, you guys. I hope y'all enjoyed this video today. I appreciate all y'all. Have a blessed day and wait for our Cat in the Moon video. Bye for now.